uh, protesters are really engaged in a kind of cat and mouse with protesters, what's, uh, with the police. What is happening is we're hearing we're hearing chants from. Oh, uh, the army! The army! Hold, hold on one the second. Hold on one second, because we're going to try to. The army is there. It looks. The army is there. Hold on. Hold on. Army guys, I have the army. Listen, uh, Laura, we're showing you live pictures right now of protesters that have run to an the armored army. vehicle that they believe is the army. Now, again, I cannot confirm that. I cannot confirm who these sources are, but you can see the celebration uh, on the faces of the protesters. A short while ago, a few minutes ago, protesters were chanting, protesters were chanting, where is the army? Come and save us. Where is the army? Come and save us. So the Egyptian military, which is very much respected and revered by the public, has been asking for them to intervene and protect them from the riot police. Now, I cannot confirm that that armored vehicle that you're seeing is the army, but the reaction from the protesters suggests that they are very happy to see it, which is very different from the scene that we've been seeing from other armored vehicles that are slightly different in color and slightly different in the personnel. What you're seeing there on the street, again, historic images yeah, 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 of yeah, people, are people are happy. the people are celebrating. I guess you can kind of make it through the trees. They're, you can see them raising their hands. Uh, and it's very important to, let me just put this in context, why it's so important, because uh, obviously the Egyptian uh, people complain to a great extent of the abuse uh, and torture they endure in their eyes from the hands of the internal security forces, the internal security uh, and a lot of plainclothes police officers. So there's a great deal of animosity from the people towards the internal uh, police services which respond to the Ministry of Interior. Now, why this would be a significant development if indeed that is a military vehicle, first it indicates that the Egyptian military has been deployed across the street. So again, we don't want to jump to conclusions, but from the reaction of the crowds, it is a suggestion that the Egyptian military is on the streets of at least in the heart of Cairo, which would be a very significant development. And very the, interesting. The fact that protesters... Sorry, uh, Amen.